Previously on College Boyfriends. You fucking amazing. You fucking amazing. You ain't gotta lie to me now. Don't lie to me. You fucking amazing. Oh, oh, oh. No, I'm not fucking him. Why would you even ask me? I know you guys. No, I'm tired of you and Kaya and every fucking body else thinking that they know me. You don't fucking know me. You don't fucking know nothing about me, first of all. Because if I was fucking this nigga, Adrian, I'd be fucking this nigga. But I'm not fucking him. Alice Fairbanks, 1915. Wow, man, so, what's next? Hey, hi. Um. My name is DeMar. I don't know Alex Fairbanks. I'm just saying I'm calling on behalf of Alex Fairbanks. Well, her son. It's a long. Is your mom home? So you know what? Wait, 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 wait. Hi. <laughs> oh my gosh, where are you going? Getting away from you. Why? I promise it's not even true. Listen, I can't fuck with y'all. Don't. Why? What are you doing? What are you doing? Why can't you fuck with us? Y'all are crazy. Y'all did that shit on purpose. So you got a virgin? Damn, I'm fucking these girls together, man. Damn. I, I got some cat wants in his scratch me. Wayne, don't start with me today. Oh! Look, it's, it's damn. If you and I could switch places. Things would probably be so much better. I love you, Kennedy. I just hope you can forgive me. Don't fucking stop, 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 stop. And you slapped me in the fucking face? Me? Who was the last person you thought about? Me. I was the last one. And all I asked you was to do one thing. One thing. One. I say. See me for who I am. Trying to keep my faith, but I'm looking for more somewhere I can feel safe and then my holy one deliver us serenity, deliver us peace, deliver us loving, 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 you know. That's why we need you now, oh I Pray for Paris, pray for the parents This is a God dream This is a God dream We on an ultra light beam, we on an ultra light beam This is a God dream, this is a God dream This is everything Everything I'm trying to keep my faith But I'm looking for more Somewhere I can feel safe And then my holy Hello? world Hi, uh, I'm sure you don't know me, but uh, Look, I've been, I've been calling around a whole lot Just over and over and over And I'm looking for someone named Jaredine Fairbanks Oh. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, great. Um, all right. So here's the deal. Uh, my name is Damari Watkins, and recently I ran into a lot of trouble. And really, I'm just looking for my relatives. And um, I would really like to talk to someone who may know. Who may know something? So, is there any way that Jaredine Fairbanks can call me?
oh, I'm free anytime, uh, especially for this. If you can just have her call me whenever she has time. Great, great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, cool. All right, yeah, just call this number back whenever. Thank you. We on an ultra light beam. We on an ultra light beam. This is a god dream. This is a god dream. This is everything. Everything. And I'm trying to keep my faith. What happened? But I'm Bro. looking for my What didn't happen? Somewhere I can't feel safe. Like, out of all the things that I would have thought Hines would have done, cheating just wasn't one of them. Yeah, he didn't really seem like the cheating type. He seemed more like the, I'm going to talk shit, but I really ain't going to do nothing type of boyfriend. And then he lied to me about it. Like, So he just all of a sudden wanted to tell you? Remember that time that I went over, I don't know if I told you, um, when I went over to his house because I felt bad, you know, about the basketball game and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. So I asked him what he did after the game and he tells me, he tells me I went out with coach and my teammate. But he was really going home with that bitch. And it's like, it's, it's like he put himself in that position, like he... He put himself in the position for that to happen. No, fuck that nigga. I'm, <laughs> I'm done. I don't think y'all done. Y'all just need to talk. No, I'm done. Kaya is done. There is no talking. I probably try to swing on him again. You swung on him? Girl, yeah, I lost my shit. I lost my shit. I can't fuck with somebody who can't keep their dick in their pants. Did he say why though? Uh, he he feels like I'm not there for him, or didn't support him. His career, whatever. You, you were a little hard on this boy, though. Because I wanted him to play more than basketball? And I agree with you. I, I totally agree with you. That doesn't mean that he's supposed to cheat on you, but I'm just saying. I don't know. We just need to give up these little college boyfriends we done had. Like, we, two, what, almost two years out of college now. We need to just move on. Score like an eagle. No, seriously. I didn't tell you about Adrian, girl. I'm not talking to him right now. What happened? This nigga gonna have the nerve, the nerve, to accuse me of fucking Corey. What? The producer guy? Yes. That's crazy. Talking about you mixing business with pleasure and so forth and so forth and you gotta be fucking up because ain't no nigga gonna do that type of shit without, you know, getting nothing from you. What, nigga? Didn't, he, he, me out for a drink? didn't he introduce y'all? Yeah. Thank you. That's the same thing I said. Like, you are the main person. You are the person that put me in the booth with this nigga. And you have the audacity to say I'm fucking him just because he took me out to get a drink. Like, keep it. What, my nigga? Oh, girl. Niggas can't handle when you do it better than 
Clearly. He's probably scared your EP was going to be better. <laughs> <laughs> and that ain't even a case. Like, my nigga just, you know, and then we got into it some weeks or some days or whatever before that because I'm not showing him enough emotion or I'm cur- I'm curving his feelings or some shit like that. I'm like, I mean, you know we love you and you Stop. do be playing with him. I do not play with that boy. See, I don't curve him. And don't get me wrong, like, I love Adrian, but I don't love Adrian. No, you love Adrian, but you don't want to love Adrian. That's where you fuck it up at. What? He's not that bad of a guy. He's not. He's not a bad guy, but it, don't it seem like I'm fucking the homie? I feel like I'm well, fucking the homie if I ever... wasn't even homies. Didn't they fight, like, three years ago? Yeah. They were not homies. Still. It's awkward. Man, fuck these niggas. Yeah, Kalani fuck, said it best. Fuck, fuck all of these niggas. Yes, okay? Fuck you, that's what she can't give my heart to these niggas. niggas. Fuck oh, all of these na 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 Always be niggas. Yes, they are. They are. Uh, but for real. I'm waiting shit. Fuck up. Let's go get some drinks. We need to. Hello? in the shop right now but alright yeah we can do that alright cool 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 you want to do me a favor what take me to the studio you gonna leave me in my time of need huh listen he just called me and asked me to come do this hook on his beat real quiet you want your condo right I don't want my fucking condo. I want my condo. Come on, my nigga. Hey, bitch, get back here. Put your damn uh, ice cream back in the freezer. You're not a guest. What the hell? Make a check. One, two, one, two. Yeah, we there. Uh, I got a lot of pride. I'm lying if I say I don't. My confidence and cockiness is on a thin rope. It's hard to stay humble cause they wanna take advantage. It's hard to dodge trouble when you caught up in the traffic. My partner had a stillborn, I ain't even called. He posted up a pic. All I did was leave a comment. What's up, BK? Are you gonna get the door in my bag anything? Really? Are you still mad? Like seriously. So you're not gonna talk? Can you just take me to the airport? BK, I'm not taking to the airport. At least, man, until we have a conversation. Are you serious, Aunt? I got a flight in like an hour. Are you serious? Like, I need to talk to you. Please don't do this right now. Oh my God. All right. All right, BK. I get it. I get it now. And I see why you put the blame on me. Cause it is my fault. I ain't mean for none of this to happen. I take all blame. I didn't take time for me to step up. I take ownership of my actions. I never wanted to make you mad. Not once. You, Kennedy, my bros, nobody. I can see I can't win for nothing. I'm in a lose lose situation every time. Because you're right. I'm the reason why Kennedy is gone. Don't say that. But it's true, and you know it. I didn't mean it when I said that, Aunt. You said it and I felt it. And I can just only imagine how Kennedy felt 
all these mutts. I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't mean to say that. I said it. I was angry though. I just lost Carter. Chase left. Now my best friend. I think and I'm feel. sorry. You know, what you said was right. Whether you was mad or not. It's gonna be okay. Don't say that. Look, I didn't mean that. It wasn't your fault. It was an accident. You had no control over it. You just have to forgive yourself. But I, and try can't, to I can't forgive myself. Because forgiving myself will not bring Kennedy back. Nothing's going to bring her back now, Aunt. But we have to deal with the situation now. How you expect me to forgive myself when you can't even forgive me? I do forgive you. I'm sorry. It's not your fault, bro. I should have never said that. I love you. See, I grew up in the city with the killers and the drug dealers. Somebody told me that they don't really fuck with you. Grinding from the dirt, I'm my own best friend. If they ain't talking money, why be talking again? I gotta hit the ground running, gotta get to the money. When I pull up in the forum, man, this shit ain't even funny. Scare me, dude. You good? Bro, I told her. Told who? I told Kaya. What you told me is that I took your advice. You told me. Boom. Start crying. Blow up. Slapping me. Scratching me. Punching me. She did. She beat my ass, bro. So I expected that, though. You feel me? I ain't expect her to go as hard, but I expected that. So then, what? Well, just know I told her. That's, I told her. Damn. Bro, it's not funny, my nigga. It's not, it's not funny. Fuck? Damn. I mean, so how she react, though? Like, what happened? Nigga, I'm here with you, ain't I? Nigga, what the fuck does that mean? Bro. All right. Boom. Boom. She come over. What? Right? I was like, we need to talk. You feel me? So, you know, you know, I, I try to start off with honesty. I told her, I was like, boom, I lied to you the other day. Transition, I tell her what happened between me and I. Boom, start crying, blow up, slapping me, scratching me, punching me. She just, she beat my ass, bro. So, I expected that, though. You feel me? I ain't expect her to go as hard, but I expected that. So then, I'm telling her what led to it, you feel me? You know, I'm like, you wasn't there, you didn't come to games, you didn't, you really didn't support what I've been trying to do. You feel me? I'm like, she kind of was there. She, she was doing the little shit that you wasn't doing. You feel me? So I'm thinking, I'm thinking she's going to be understanding. Her response is, God damn, ooh, I want you to be more than just a ball player. I want you to be more than just a nigga that know how to dribble the ball up and down the court. Like, what the fuck? Like, just... Allow me to do that. I mean, I can kind of see what she's saying, though, bro. You know what I'm saying? What? I mean, she she just don't want you to put all your eggs in one basket. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to be a well-rounded person. Bro, bro, you really sound like her right now. Like, what the fuck? I mean, like I said, like, I'm not agreeing with her, but I can see where she's coming from. See, 
People say, if you believe in what you're doing, you got to take that leap of faith. I believe in what I can do. So I'm trying to leap, but y'all motherfuckers don't want me to motherfucking leap. That's not true. That's not true, bro. No. Boy. That's everything that you just said, that's true. You got to take a leap of faith. You got to put, you know what I'm saying, all your, your energy and your faith in what you want to do, which is basketball. But all she's saying is, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you don't understand how I feel, like, oh, for nobody you. to accept who you are, like, what you're trying to do, like, I you, no, you don't. I bro, feel you. I feel I've been with her for, like, damn near three years, and I've been trying to get her to just accept me. I want to play ball. This is who I am. Take it or leave it. You're listening, bro. Yeah, man. Listening. Everything is just going over your head, bro, man. She understands that. No. She does understand it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, she don't. She don't. You don't. You, you don't you don't know the feeling like you don't know how it really feels for nobody except you for for who you really are like you don't understand what that feels like man you don't everybody you don't accept you can't tell me i don't know what it feels can't. like bro. everybody like everybody you accept like, you man don't nobody accept me man okay can how they don't so, how does that feel what do you mean huh? okay so they don't accept you you know how that feels do you know how that feels because you're dealing with this temporarily i'm dealing with this shit every day my nigga this is weird. What are you? What are you? I'm dealing about? with myself every day, man. Oh. My thoughts, my self-conscious. Okay. Okay. All right. So, so apparently it's something more. So since this is honesty hour, you wanted me to be so honest. I had to be so honest. What the fuck? You be honest. What the hell are you talking about? What, what is it that you deal with in your mind that people don't accept? Please tell me something that I don't know. What are you talking about? Everybody don't accept me, man. Okay. Who do, who who doesn't accept you? You not finna accept me in a minute. You ain't gonna understand this shit, bro. Bro, when am I not gonna understand? Bro, you tripping? My life. Life is crazy, man. What about what about your life, my nigga? No, no issues. No, no, no. I know you don't see him, man. Nobody got to deal with this shit but me. Nobody can judge me. Bro, what are you talking about? Who's going to judge me? What? You can judge me. I'm... Dad can judge me. Bro, what are you dealing with? What, bro, what are you talking about? I'm gay, bro. There you go. Hey, you got it. I'm gay, man. <laughs> Stupid as fuck. What? what? Glad you did this shit for me, man. <laughs> bro, you playing, right? But yeah, ain't you playing? This ain't nothing. It's fucking hard. You serious about this? Chill, chill, chill. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wasn't trying to joke about it. Two. Uh, okay, Cam, you say you gay, so that's your question. Like, bro, since when? So, man, since I can remember. My nigga, I done known you for too long. Why you ain't never say nothing? How can I tell you some shit bro, like that, man? See, because. Is this this is mean, cause man. look, this is what you don't understand. Accepting, man. This shit is not accepting. But this is what you said. You, you said I don't know you, right? But well apparently you don't know me because this, at the end of the day, bro, okay, we've been bros too long, my nigga. You you in my circle, my nigga. Once you in my circle, you in there, there is no getting out. My nigga, I go to war with you, my nigga. Nigga, squares don't fit in circles, my dude. So because you gay, that makes you a square is what you're trying to tell me. So, That's what the world say, man. So let me ask you a question. That's what my dad gonna say when I tell him. Fuck what your dad gonna say, man. Fuck that nigga, bro.
Bro, it don't matter, my nigga, if you green, blue, black, gay, transvestite, you like to wear girl clothes, everybody, bro, you my hey, guy. Hey, I don't know. You gotta accept me. See, this is the thing. You, you can't tell me whether or not I'm accept you. Now, how you gonna tell me that? You, you, just like I told you, you don't understand it. You just said I don't understand. How you gonna tell me how I'm gonna feel, bro? This is how I feel, my nigga. You my nigga. I don't give a fuck. If that's what make you happy, nigga, be happy. I don't give a fuck, nigga. It's not that easy, man. It, bro, it's that easy, my nigga. If this is the lifestyle you want to live, live the shit. Why the fuck you give a fuck what anybody else has to think? Only thing that matters to me is, bro, you, you didn't think our friendship was strong enough when you could have told me the truth. Bro, you my nigga, bro. I don't give a fuck, bro. When it, when it come to your dad, bro, even if you don't never want to tell a nigga, fuck that nigga, bro. You ain't got to never tell that nigga. You got a bro right here, my nigga. I got your back regardless, nigga. Fuck, fuck everybody. Fuck what the world think. Nigga, fuck whatever friends you say, because guess what? You got a friend right here that gives no fucks. That's not how many fucks I give. None. I can't, I can't find no fucks to give. Fuck it, nigga. We ride or die, nigga. See, you should just gave me some of them hoes in high school you had. Damn, nigga. You didn't even need them bitches. See, you... You was stealing the girls I could have got. Nigga, what's wrong with you? That could have been both of me. <laughs> so now I got a question whether or not you stingy or not. That's what, oh, that's what's going. Bro, you my nigga, bro. You feel me? Like, bro, that shit don't, bro. It's the thing. You should just been straight with me from the beginning, bro. Sure. About, about, and I can say I understand, you feel me? I guess. Shit, we both got to learn to be out of the bus when you talking about shit. <laughs> but I know one thing, I'm not listening to you no more. I'm not being honest. <laughs> nigga, that shit got me beat up. Nigga, you talking about you hear me? Good, bro. We good, man. I appreciate you. You owe me a girlfriend, though. I just want you to know that. I don't understand why you even, why are you even still talking to him? Naomi, I need closure. I need, I need to get over this. I need to, I need to move on. I don't know. I just need to talk to him. Maybe talking to him will help out a little bit. How about with us? You should have been got closure. Like, how long has it been? Like, I'm, why are you, oh, why is he still a factor? Oh my gosh. I don't get it. And then why are you talking to him here? You could have taken him to a park. Naomi. Like, a, what? Because yeah. I don't understand. Please enlighten me. I don't get it. What's wrong with you talking to him here? What is the problem? Didn't you move away for him? I did not move away because of him. I moved away because it was cheaper. I moved away because it's nicer. I moved away because I don't hear gunshots. Out. Everybody just keep asking me why I'm moving. Because that's my decision. And maybe, uh, maybe, just maybe, I still love him. And that's a problem. No, it's not. Yes, it's not it a, problem. That's a problem. No, it's not a yes, problem. It maybe I need to see what life would be like if we had a decent conversation. We just need to have it. So. He's coming over. Well, I guess. Well, you can just call me when y'all done, cause no, mm -mm -mm -mm. we're not gonna be long. Just sit down. Sit yeah. down. Eat. I know you like to eat. Oh <sighs> my gosh, you get on my nerves. Okay, please don't be long, for real. I'm not. Cause I'm, I'm really trying to catch this movie. You already stressed me out. Okay. Okay. Go to the bathroom. Mm-hmm. And answer the door when he comes, please. Right. Hey, how you doing? Mm -hmm. yeah. Sierra? Yeah. It's here. Hey. Hey. You can you can come back. You want to close the door? Uh, yeah. Yeah.
you been? Probably good. Good. And how are you? You know, I'm better than I used to be, I guess. So what was up? You called me and stuff. I I wanted you to um come over so we could have a conversation. So talk about your day. You can go sit down. So, um, <clears throat> Demaria, uh, our relationship has has never been good. And, um, over the past year, I've had so many things that I wanted to say to you, but um, I guess I needed, I needed time, and um, I needed the words, I guess, so I brought you over here so I could talk to you about how I've been feeling for a little while. Fear. I can't move on unless we can be two adults and have a conversation with one another. And I guess my first question is, why? Why did you do that? Why, why did our relationship have to go that way? What did I do to you to make you so angry with me? Did I do something? Mario? <clears throat> um, we didn't do anything. I'm at a point in my life where I, I need I stop making excuses. Alright? And if nothing else, it's all me. It's all me. This is my problem. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't accept that. It's the truth. It's the honest truth. Since we broke up, I've, I've cried, fought, I went to jail, I got out, I got counseling, I've gotten help. I'm, I'm a way different person than when we were dating. That whole relationship ain't the same person you're talking to. I can throw out. All but if I didn't do anything, then why did you hit me? I don't know, and you were just there, and it's not fair to you. It's not. I understand you have every right to hate me. I get but that's the honest truth. I have, that's all I have for you. That's, that's what it is. And, uh, there ain't no excuse. And I'm sorry. I don't know if you're willing to accept that. And I didn't come over here so you could. I didn't even know what you wanted to talk about when you called me. But, you know, I did my damage. I paid a couple prices for that. And, all I can do now is just, just move forward and, and hopefully the truth will, will um, help you to move forward too. Everything I said was the truth. You didn't do anything. It was all me. I can't keep on blaming everything else in my situation. And that's, that's what it was. And if you can't take that, I really don't even know what to give you because I don't have nothing else to give. Demaria, you were supposed to love me. That's what you could have gave me. The same affection that I gave you. The same time that I tried to give you. 
I put everything to the side for you. Everything. My family. My friends. And and I hear you're sorry. I hear it. And and it sounds good, but so did the other times you said sorry. And every time you said sorry, I got another bruise. I got another black eye. What makes this sorry so different? And all this time, people been asking me, what was so bad about your relationship that made you skip graduation and act the way you do? And I said nothing. I said nothing because I love you. I, I loved you. And my love for you was so much stronger than my hate. I could never really hate you. I want you to have your brother back. I want you to have a good life. I want you to have a great relationship with any, someone. You keep saying I'm sorry. I don't want you sorry. Matter of fact, fuck your sorry. All right, Sierra. I won't say sorry no more. So can I go? Can you go? I. This did not. Yeah. Like, what do you want me to say? I don't want to stay here and just listen to you do this. If you want to move forward, go ahead. I'm cool with it. Demar. Demarie. That is. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That is what I'm talking about. No. Mm. -mm. <laughs> no, you can't leave, Damari, and I'm sorry if I feel like I'm trapping you again. However, I can't move forward in life with with just you leaving. And I apologize that things get hard on Damari and he decides he wants to storm out of the room. No, you. we have to talk about this. Okay, well then talk, Sierra. Like, you just <laughs> chastising me the whole time. I'm not chastising you. I'm getting things off of my chest so I can feel better. All right, well, just... You moving forward and I just, I can't move forward without talking to you. I, I'm just... Okay, you I'm, know what? Sierra, what you want from me? I, I'm trying to move forward. I'm not saying I already did. I'm just saying I'm... I've been trying to move forward for a long time now, and I'm not expecting you to have it together. I understand what you want to get off your chest, but you still haven't gotten it off yet. And I can't give you nothing. Like, why don't you, what do you want from me? Just do what you got to do but to get over it, but don't keep me in it. Man. I can't get over it because of you, Demarie. Don't you understand that? You keep saying I haven't said what I wanted to say, but I'm saying it. You're not hearing me. I can't move on i can't give myself to another person because i'm still stuck on you i have a man in my life a real man in my life and i can't even love him the way that he deserves to be loved because of you and it feels so good to have a real man in your life that loves you the way that you deserve to be loved and that cares for you the way that you're supposed to be cared for and touches you the way you're supposed to be touched so you are you fucking this nigga What happened to, um, waiting for marriage, Sierra? I never said I was waiting for marriage. I said I was waiting for the right one. And, um, and Amari, 
I didn't fuck him. I made love to him. I'm 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 Why would you hit me? Why would you do that? Let me Did you fucking hit her? Did you fucking hit her? Naomi. Are you fucking serious right now? Why the fuck would you hit her? Naomi. You gonna hit me? Oh, I want you to. Hit me. Naomi. No, we're gonna call the police right now. Get up. Come on. Come on, get no. up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Come on. And I loved you, but we ain't never gonna be together. Now you can go. Love you too, Sierra. I was good on my own, that's the way you was That's the way you was You were good on the low for a faded love On some faded love Tell me what you keep complaining for Feeling jaded or oh. Used to trip off the things I was kicking to you Had some fun on the run though, I'll give it to you But baby, don't get it twisted Cause you were just another hitter on a hit list Trying to fix your inner issues with a bad chick Didn't they tell you that I was a savage? Took you white horse in a carriage Bet you never could imagine Never told you you could have it You need So basically you're not a virgin And then not only are you not a virgin Layla, But you're catching things no. And not telling me the truth Oh, oh, let's not forget really that you not had me hang with friends. Layla, 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 listen. Let me just sit down so I can talk to you. Oh, look, I'm, just, look, I'm just trying to make everything right. Like, listen, I'm, I'm not a virgin. I had sex. Oh, just one, it, just one time, just one time, and it, it was with the wrong person. It, 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 it was a mistake. Like it was the biggest mistake of, of my life, and I don't I don't know how to fix it. It seems like it's messing everything up. And yes, I I, I caught a I caught a disease. I ca I caught something, but get it out. Come on, like talk. Listen, I was embarrassed to tell you because of that. Look, I'm good now, but. I didn't want you to look at me differently because that's not me. It's 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 not something I'm proud of. Okay, but I've always told you to just be honest with me. Like you can talk to me about anything. Like I don't care. But I, I mean, I care now. That's not something I would want to tell anybody. But I was your girlfriend. Like I'm I'm confused. Like I'm we're we're friends. Like, I didn't I'm, I didn't I'm know girlfriend. anybody else that that finds okay. out. It's, it's right. they judge. That's why I'm in the situation I'm in now. Mm -hmm. and, it's just so much, and I, I just don't know how to fix all my mistakes right now. Like, I'm just trying to be honest with you about everything, and and you know what? I, I should have told you about. I should I should have told you about the girls. Okay. Whoa. They wouldn't have made sense. I mean, you just had me like. Listen, you I'll, up here talking to them, and then they all up in my face being no, my friend. No, I, this is what happened. This is what happened. Like, Listen, I went to a party. They were there. And you know, I was I was kind of drunk under the influence and everything, and, and you know, they was they was on me, and they was touching on me and trying to kiss on me and stuff, and I just felt guilty because when he was doing it, I kind of you know wanted them to keep going, but what makes it even worse is that I felt I just felt as guilty as if I did have sex with them. 
because you could have avoided all that. No, I'm telling you the truth now. Okay. Yes, you're right. No, I'm you're telling you me. all the truth now. Like, I'm just trying to get everything out before I leave. Like, wait, leave, wait, leave, where are you going? You already know what's been going on between, you know, with my mom's situation and everything. I just need to leave so I can try to be there for her too. Like, like I'm not even worried about this situation anymore. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to tell you the truth because, you know, you matter and I, I really want you to know what's going on with me and what's going on with us. But I just want to be there for her right now. I understand. I get it. You need to focus on you. I need to focus on me and shit. I mean, stuff. Uh, okay. I need to go back to being Layla. Like, the new and approved. Layla Summer. That's right. Yeah. I'm gonna stop letting people run over me and manipulate me and persuade me to do things that's not really Layla ish. So, yeah, I get you. You got stuff that you need to grow and focus on, and so do I. You okay? You know, I said I was going to come into this year, you know, being my own man, mm -hmm. being my own person, and, and just, you know, and just stay focused. I felt like I just I didn't do any of that and I, I just messed all that up but I feel like when I leave this time I feel like I'm going to actually change but I'm just I'm really thankful that you that you forgive me and that you understand like like seriously you don't understand how much that means to me okay. like you just lifted a, a whole weight off of me and you really you're the best for that okay you're my only girlfriend I ever had, but I mean, you're the best. I missed, I just messed that up. It's okay. It's okay. And we're gonna, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be serious. We're gonna, we're gonna be okay. Can we still be friends? Yeah. We won't go stop being friends. I won't go nowhere. Come on. I always got your back, okay? I'm tired. Fuck. Oh. I thought sleep was for suckers. Man, you right, you right. I just want to lay down. Ah, shit, I just want to smoke, man. You smoke? Yes. Shit, you don't look like no smoker, man. <laughs> That's a good thing, right? Shit, hell yeah. I don't need 
what you trying to do? You trying to fire up? You got some? Shit. Um. What the fuck I do with that time bag? Shit, I lied, you know. I, I know I smoked that shit earlier. Party foul. Trying to go to the crib, though. You know, I got some over there. You know, we could have a little vibe session, smoke a little bit. I know you probably write better when you smoke anyway. <laughs> Don't act like you know me. Nah, but... I didn't drive, so... Shit, you can ride with me, and I'll just drop you off earlier. It ain't no issue. Yeah, it's kind of late. Man, it's not even that late anyways. What else you got to do? Come on, nah, nah, eh? I know you want to smoke with the kid. Come on now. Nah. Just be a little quick session. Come there and come back. Alright. Alright, cool. We can do that. Yeah, let's ride then. Let's go. Next time on College Boyfriends. What movies you got though? You ain't trying to watch a movie. My all-time favorite movie right here, man. <laughs> juice. Yo, put juice on that shit funny. So you and that nigga, uh, that, that shit, that's your boo? I'm so tired, asking me that. Shit, I mean, y'all always together, so you know, I was just trying, you know, see what was happening with you. feel me? Like, what's up, guy? I'm not, I'm not gonna do this as often as I should. But I guess it really took me to to someone that I really care for to give me on my knees to pray to. Alright, so, uh, how about this? What did you learn? Because you really got over it. You know, you got a lesson from it. Uh. Gosh. I want to say something. What did I learn? Yeah. I look this way too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I learned that love can be your strength, but it can also be your weakness. What? I'm done with this. I'm done being this person. Tiana, I'm... It's all good, Tiana. It's all good. I'm done. Tiana, I'm done. It ain't even that big of a deal no more, you know, because... You know, she she put me she put me in a real fucked up spot, and then she had me going all over the place. I had to leave because I started thinking some shit I didn't want to think no more, and it's all good. So it's all good, all right.